In kidney transplant cases, the vasculature on the donor graft may require modifications in order to optimize implantation to the recipient. In this case, two renal arteries on the graft are joined via a side-to-side -side arterioplasty technique. In order to allow a single arterial anastomosis, during implantation of the kidney in the recipient. To begin, the arteries are first spatulated, forming V-shaped openings on their adjacent walls. A double-armed suture is run through the apices on the proximal end. Another double-armed suture is run through the corners for the posterior wall. These form the stay sutures. The arteries are brought together and the suture at the apices is first tied, while the distal suture is left open. One arm of the proximal double-armed suture is repositioned to be posterior of the anastomosis. Using this arm, the posterior wall is constructed using a continuous suture. The posterior wall stay suture is tied first. The continuous suture arm is tied subsequently completing the posterior wall construction. A double-armed suture is placed on through the corners of the anterior wall, acting as a stay suture. The distal corners are brought together. Using the remaining arm from the proximal end, a continuous suture is made to construct the anterior wall. Similar to the posterior wall, the stay suture is tied first, followed by the continuous suture arm. The suture arms are trimmed, completing the side-to-side -side arterioplasty.